Welcome to Volga Facts, your go-to channel for interesting, thought-provoking topics and the weird and wonderful news from all over the world. Today, we're diving into a fascinating aspect of meteorology, why hurricanes never cross the equator. If you've ever wondered about this natural phenomenon, stick around as we unravel the science behind it. Introduction Hurricanes, typhoons, and cyclones are powerful weather systems that can cause widespread destruction. However, one intriguing fact about these storms is that they never cross the equator. This behavior is tied to fundamental principles of physics and the Earth's rotation. Let's explore the reasons behind this phenomenon. The Coriolis Effect The primary reason hurricanes don't cross the equator is due to the Coriolis Effect. Named after the French scientist Gaspard Gustave de Coriolis, this effect describes how the rotation of the Earth influences the movement of objects across its surface. How the Coriolis effect works. The Earth rotates from west to east, and this rotation causes moving air to be deflected to the right in the northern hemisphere and to the left in the southern hemisphere. This deflection is crucial for the formation and movement of hurricanes. In the Northern Hemisphere, the Coriolis effect causes winds to spiral counterclockwise around a low-pressure center, which is characteristic of hurricanes. In the Southern Hemisphere, the effect causes winds to spiral clockwise. At the equator, the Coriolis effect is essentially zero. This means there is no force to cause the necessary spin for hurricane formation or to sustain the storm structure. Formation of Hurricanes Hurricanes form over warm ocean waters, typically when the sea surface temperature is at least 26.5 degrees Celsius, about 80 degrees Fahrenheit. This warm water provides the energy needed for the storm to develop. As warm, moist air rises, it creates a low-pressure area beneath it. Air from surrounding areas with higher pressure pushes into this low-pressure area, and then this new air becomes warm and moist and rises too. This cycle continues, and the Coriolis effect helps to create the characteristic rotating structure of the storm. Barrier at the equator As hurricanes move, their paths are influenced by the Coriolis effect. Since this effect is non-existent at the equator, a hurricane cannot maintain its rotational structure if it were to approach this region. Without this rotational force, the storm would lose its organized structure and dissipate. Equatorial Wind Patterns In addition to the Coriolis effect, equatorial wind patterns play a role in preventing hurricanes from crossing the equator. The Intertropical Convergence Zone IECZ, is a region near the equator where trade winds from the northern and southern hemispheres meet. This area is characterized by low wind speeds and a lack of significant Coriolis effect. The ITCZ acts as a barrier that disrupts the development and movement of tropical cyclones. Historical Data Historically, no tropical cyclone has been observed to cross the equator. The dynamics of storm formation and the physical forces at play make it virtually impossible for these systems to sustain themselves near the equator. Meteorological records and satellite observations confirm that hurricanes remain confined to their respective hemispheres. Unusual weather phenomena While hurricanes don't cross the equator, other weather phenomena can occur near this region. For example, equatorial troughs and monsoons are common. These systems are driven by different mechanisms and don't rely on the Coriolis effect in the same way hurricanes do. Conclusion Understanding why hurricanes never cross the equator involves appreciating the complex interplay of the Earth's rotation, atmospheric dynamics, and oceanic conditions. The Coriolis effect and equatorial wind patterns are key factors that keep these powerful storms in check. Call to Action Thank you for watching Volga Facts. If you found this topic fascinating and want to learn more about the weird and wonderful aspects of our world, make sure to hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click the bell icon so you never miss.